So today we're gonna to go over how to make a medicine ball out of a spare ball that you may have in your uh, garage or shed. Um, we're gonna fill it with water. So I'm gonna go over the few steps it takes to get to this finished product right here. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is find um, the little hole that you would normally put air in to the ball. And you wanna take your needle nose pliers and just dig in on either side. This is probably the hardest part of it. And I'm not worried about popping. So once you get it, once you get a good piece of it, you wanna pull, oh, that didn't work, let's try again. This might take you a few, a few tries. Get it nice and deep, give it a pull. That thing should come out. Don't wanna break it if we can help it. Let me go a little bit more. If you can grab it like that, that's even better. Cause now I can get lower on it. So I got a screwdriver, um, because this is an older ball, the little piece broke off, the little rubber piece. So now I'm just gonna push this in. Okay. So now we have access to the center of the ball. Okay, we'll, we'll fix that later. So this is working here. Kind of jam it and seal it up and it goes in the hole and then just release the pressure every once in a while last step is to take some tubing um, just regular tubing see it right there and just just get it in there um, you can use a screwdriver if you could have salvaged the actual valve then that just kind of pops back in fairly easily um, but this is just this will do as well as we get it in as soon as I squeeze it I could already see it's it's not really leaking so um, I just want to get it a little deeper And then we can cut it. Good, cool. There we go. Okay. So now you just cut the ends here. Thing's not leaking. Come, it's just that's just water that was there. So you have this thing. Um, you could definitely do a lot with this. Um, so yeah, that's how you make a medicine ball.